shea butters. I will use it to make to pick up sheer butter I want to use it to make something oh yeah I think I need something else too hello um, we have some hair stuff for kids Wait. oh here I have some beads Different beads for kids. We have a lot of wigs as well. Plenty of wigs, different colors. It's a beauty hair supply. Oh my goodness, like, yeah. These are the type of places when you come, you get confused. <laughs> you might come for one thing. I get so confused on what to take. Anyways, let me not get confused or get carried away by all of this. I will use it to make so I will use this to make a body butter or body cream or body lotion body cream yeah body cream so it's going to be in my winter skincare routine yeah skincare routine I don't know if it's skincare routine but I will make a proper video when I will be making this turning it into butter and I will tell you how we take care of our skin and I will review all that product as well I stopped at the farmer's market to pick up these fresh eggs. These eggs are, I don't know how fresh they are, but because it's from a farmer's uh, market, it is pretty, pretty fresh. I know I prefer brown eggs to white eggs, but I normally buy mostly white eggs because 
white eggs are more popular in the grocery store so whenever I have the time to go to the farmers market I will always pick up this uh, these ones and these ones are I think it's extra large I can't remember if it's extra large or jumbo size so they have the small size which is very very tiny uh, the medium size large size extra large yeah this is extra large and then the jumbo size the jumbo ones have two yolks I don't like those ones I have two yolks but this will last us for some time okay I bought how many 24 and 12 pieces yeah but the, the rest of the grocery I bought from that bulk grocery store that I took you guys to uh, in one of my videos so I'm just trying to prepare everything clean everything I think on this day I was off from work so I was able to go to because the farmers market opens only on Fridays and on Saturdays it's not far from me but it, the, the farmers market I mean the farmers market in my city it opens only on Fridays and on Saturdays so those are the only time you can go and pick up things Mungwa, come on this side. Start on this side. Start loosening this side. You know how to take up braids. So that will be even faster. Yeah. Who is right? If it's twist, you just twist, twist this out, and then you start on braiding the. The, the one that is three strand braids okay you need to learn how to do this you need to learn how to even braid your sister's hair that's how me and my sisters did that's how i learned how to braid because we were braiding each other's hair being a mother of two daughters with fussy hair it is so tasking to make their hair so during the summer time that was last summer 2023 i micro locked my daughter's hair so you can see the braid it still has the twist because it's going to take very long time for the twist for it to turn into locks itself but for now it's working for mm -hmm. us but for her sister i know she's not going to be able to sit for me to micro lock her hair it takes a long time to finish her hair it takes a long time to braid her hair and it causes her a lot of anxiety and stress whenever you come to doing her hair same thing with me it causes me a lot because knowing that she's going to be stressed it stresses me out and it takes a long time to unbraid the hair to wash the hair and then to rebraid it it's a long it's a lot of work so god bless mamas abroad because they are the jack of all trade and master of it all, okay? <laughs>
<laughs> okay oh guys so i am done with her hair <laughs> finally this is almost one o'clock i'm going to go and freshen myself up and um, i'm going outside i have a few places to go here and there mostly window shop this weekend i was just focusing on their hair um i washed victoria's hair already that was the day before so now it's a little bit dry i'm going to retighten it oh, that's what i'm doing here her sister's hair i washed it but i wasn't able to braid it it's a lot of work it's a lot of work okay i'm not gonna lie it's a lot of work and just retightening her hair victoria's hair it takes about five hours just to retighten her hair i'm not talking about washing washing doesn't take so much time but retightening it takes quite some time so that's what i'm doing here this weekend was just about hair maintenance taking care of their hair and look at my own hair who takes care of my who takes care of my hair my own hair is neglected neglected why i take care of their hair well, that's what it takes to be a mom of two girls with uh, fussy hair her hair is not natural like i used to um text lacks her hair so that's why you can see how the the braid is falling down right it's not shrinking like it's, it doesn't have a lot of shrinkage because it was text lacks before i turned it into i turned it into locks wow yeah so the bottom is locked as you can see i'm just locking it now i try to lock it every six to eight weeks and then i lock the base Beautiful Ada, huh? Our beautiful Ada, Tono, eh, eh. Our beautiful Ada with her dry skin. I have to make um, I have to make a, a face mask for her. I will carry you guys along when I'll be making that face mask for her, cause this is dry season. Her face or her body, this is nice. It's very nice, very neat, very very neat. This is my hand work. You guys come and patronize me. Come and patronize me. My beautiful Ada. Huh? My one and only Ada. Look at her. Uh-huh. 
My one and only Ada. Hmm? Ada Jejemba. Nena Yeba. Look up to me, Ada Jejemba. Hey! Ada Jejemba. <laughs> Chica, I'm so Jejemba. Chica, I'm so Jejemba. <laughs> 